1,300. They came out well. 1,300 in front of them, and Luna Rush is an early leader. Rushes off for a good early position. Poster Girls at the fence, also looking to hold that early barrier, is racing two lengths off. Caddy Master, the white face between them. Over towards the outside, looking to improve Chap Traps, also trying to get across. Golden Ball towards the outside of these runners. Structured Reply, three lengths off. The King of Random towards the inside. Races four lengths off the tempo. Orange Silks of Truth of Beauty looks to get a length closer. Over towards their inside is Ocean Drive South. The way we make him gets a scrub of the bit towards the inside. Elmer looks also off the bridle, awkward around the turn. Looks like Piggy's Dream is the trailer. Luna Rush at the top of the lane has the lead by a neck. Towards the outside, Chap Trap, Caddy Master, Poster Girl goes in. 300 to go. Luna Rush now, Oster Run. And Luna Rush goes by a half a length. Towards the outside, Chap Trap, Poster Girl's on the inside. Luna Rush looking to build on that lead, 150 to go. And it's Luna Rush in command by a length and a half. Anthony Del Pesce says, Go, win this, go stand in the queue. Luna Rush to win. The second spot, the way we make him, flew up with the King of Random, second and third in photos. Poster girl behind these runners. Number 10, Luna Rush, the daughter of Wind Rush, has come good. Anthony Del Pesh had her in a striking position, and she comes good from the Duncan House camp. Second to Karari Falcon, and she'll win by about two and a half lengths. The way we make him and the King of Random flash by second and third. The way we make him on the inside, the King of Random third. So perhaps the way we make him second, the King of Random, it's obscured yet. It's quite a difficult picture yet to gauge, not the clearest picture yet. So we'll go the way we make him just ahead of the King of Random, but wait for the judge's confirmation. Poster girl on the inside and then structured reply. Luna Rush, she was burning coming to the 400 meter marker. Anthony Del Pesh whipping the left hand and asking her to run and go away for the victory. The KZN Yelling Sail Million belongs to number 10. Luna Rush pays up at 4 Rand 40 the win, 1 Rand 60 the place. That's the running of race number 9. Still plenty of activity to get involved with. Anthony Del Pesh will bring this for the Duncan House camp. Well done to all the connections. The KZN Yearling Sale Million, a great race uh, to win if you bought at uh, the KZN Yearling uh, Sales uh, the previous year. As a two-year-old, you come out, you qualify, and it's a fantastic stake on offer, that first stake of 625,000 Rand. Joining us for the winning presentation, Mr. Kurs de Klack, who is the director of Gold Circle, and Vesda Feinberg, the manager of sales from the Bloodstock South Africa company. Thanks, guys, for coming down. Vesna, we had the pleasure of meeting you. Kurs is here. First off, let's have the winning trainer, Duncan House. And uh, Duncan, uh, compliments to yourself on your team. Uh, this looked like a race in mind, and all she needed to do was get in. You took your chance, and, and she got in, and she was obviously a runner on their last run. Uh, she definitely was, yes. Uh, she showed me tremendous improvement at home. And, you know, second start, I said to the guys, this filly will be in the first three today. She ran a very forward race, and again, she improved after that. So I was expecting a very good run tonight. Uh, this filly uh, obviously bought it, the, the KZN sale. You must have really liked her that day. Yes, uh, we actually trained her mother, Romantic Moon. She won eight races for us. I'd just like to say well done to all the partners. A couple of guys not yet today, Pat Garden, Amir. Well done, guys. Uh, it's a plan come together. It's been a long-term thing. It's taken us two years to get you, and I'm very happy for everybody involved. How was your sale uh, this year, Duncan, for next year's race? Kathy always does a great job at the sales. My job is just to train them. If I could just say well done to Bull and Stud. They bred a very nice filly, and I think this filly's progressive. So you're going to see a lot more of her in the future. Well done, Duncan. Thank you. Well done to the winning trainer, Duncan Howells, receiving uh, that uh, winning memento from Vesna Feinberg, the manager of sales from Bloodstock, South Africa. Next up, let's have the winning jockey. And I think he's going to have to thank me first before he thanks the winning connections. But well done, yeah, Anthony. Uh, you gave this filly a super confident ride. 
yeah, she came out very well, and I was quite happy to lead because she she looks like she knows what to do, and yeah, and uh, Shmanga just stayed on the outside of me, and uh, yeah, it came to straight. She quickened up very well, and I got after her. She just kept digging in and giving me more all the way. She looks like a filly that's improving. Obviously, you sat on her for the first time in the race. Uh, a filly that give you a, a good feel. Yeah, not much of her, but I think she's got a big heart, and you know, the margin that she won, obviously, she's she's going to go and win more races. Well, you got two on the board. Uh, well played today. Uh, thus far, that is. You've got a few more to come, but well done with this win. You've had back-to-back -back wins in this uh, race now. Last year, cutting edge. This year, Lunar Rush. Yeah, thanks very much to Duncan. You know, I don't ride much for him, but every time he puts me on one, I win on it. So, I really appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, it's been a very good day. And for us jockeys, we enjoy riding in this, this atmosphere. It's been fantastic. My filly didn't run... Uh, too good in the in the big race, uh, but she didn't disappoint herself. I think she'll come back stronger for Lee next year. Well done, winning jockey Anthony Del Pesh for trainer Duncan Owls. Now all the owners: Pat Gounden, Duncan Owls, Al Kayam, Mrs. Uh, Perik Mojin, my good mate, Gary Rich. Let's get all the guys in. Come together. Let's have a chat. Let's get all the guys in and. Uh, I had a chat with Perik about this filly uh, some time back after her last win and he suggested as well, you know, she could be a good ride in this race. Perik, a plan come together? 100% Dees, you know, we worked it out about three weeks ago, I said please look at this uh, race, I want Anthony to ride the horse for us. We had it prepped for the, for the race. Big thank you to Duncan and Cathy and the team at home, you know, great ride by Anthony. To my partners, you know, Garth had a tough week, his son's just had an op and he came back last night from Pretoria. This is to Will, that's at home watching. This is for you. And Eugene, Eugene as well, Borland Stud. Thanks very much. You know, these this case in the cell, it's really worth it. Great initiative, it's a great race. We put on the cell, we bought it back for 220 and now we've been rewarded. And what about Duncan? I mean, he's just done an outstanding job. He mentioned that Cathy goes and picked the horses and of course they really like the horse and you guys got involved. 100%. You know, obviously we owned the mayor that was very good to us. Uh, they did a good job. Kathy picks him, Duncan trains him, and he's a great trainer. It's an awesome return in a year for your money that you spent at the sale. Well, I need it for what I lose you on the golf course, Steve. <laughs> so about time I got something back. Well done, P, and well done to God. God, come through. Come have a last chat. Uh, you're having a rough week with, with your kid, etc. But this should, uh, you know, brighten the day. Oh, this is unbelievable, really. Duncan's a master. Anthony rode a brilliant race. We, I've been racing with Perrick for I don't know how long. It's just fantastic, man. Unbelievable. Well, enjoy the moment. Well done to the guys. They're representing the owners, Garth and uh, Perrick. And well done to the other owners as well, Pat Gounden, Duncan Howells. And uh, a fantastic moment for these guys with Luna Rush. The gentleman that takes care of the filly, his name is Gerald Kobane. Gerald, you've done an outstanding job, my man. Well done to the winning group. Gerald Kubane, uh, who takes care of Luna Rush. Gerald Kubane, well played, my man. Uh, a big thank you to Kuis de Klack, director of Gold Circle, and Vesna Feinberg coming down and assisting us with the winning presentation. The Million Rand Race, the KZN Yearling Million, belongs to Luna Rush, number 10 on the card.